boys love the M35, Mako. It's got heart, you know? Oh, come on. The M44 Hammerhead is vastly superior. Come on, that thing's made of tissue paper. At least the Mako can take a few hits. I'd hope so. That thing handles like a drunk rhino. No agility whatsoever. More like a bull that can... It only climbs because of its stupid, vertically aligned mass effect fields. Jump or stick. No speed. No lateral movement. Hey, with a cannon like that, who needs to move? If you want that, why don't you just stick with the old M29 Grizzly? Hey, I love that tank. <laughs> you would be one to love grizzly bears, Mr. Vega. <laughs> what? What's so funny? doesn't pilot Normandy, she is the Normandy. 
No, she's a passenger in the Normandy, just like us. The ship was a space-faring vessel before Edie even existed. Engineer Donnelly is correct. The Normandy SR2 was completely spaceworthy prior to my installation. Edie can direct the Normandy with her thoughts. She sees, hears, and feels through the ship's sensor arrays. The Normandy is her body. I've seen Edie's body, and its curves are a fine sight better than the Normandy's hull. So what do you think, Edie? Are we more than our thoughts? I'm done. Any more of this and my head's gonna explode. That GX-12 thermal pipe arrived. We're performing the modifications right now. Hey, Commander. I dug out some letters my youngest sister wrote when she was in high school. She was... having a hard time. Teen drama and all that. Just needed her big sis. I guess with everything that happened down there, I just wanted to read them again. You sure make some unusual friends, Shepard. Everybody was fighting the Rachni, trying to push them back through the relay. Finally, the Krogan were turned loose and stopped them. I see. But when the Krogan rebelled, we had to deploy the Genophage to stop them. It wasn't the only rebellion. A thousand years later, the Geth revolted against the Quarians. That was a whole other war. Then along came the humans. My own people tangled with them for a while, and now, to top it all off, we've got the Reapers. What about you? The Ouroboros fought the Densorin. The Andoromai conquered the Vanduma, and the Jatil turned against the Jar. So, I guess nobody really ever gets their act together. The Sinriel claimed to have found the path to eternal peace. What happened? The Ditika preferred war and wiped them out. I hope you guys had alcohol. Some of the crew seem shocked by the monstrosities we have encountered. They haven't seen what the Reapers could corrupt after a hundred years. That was our war. Every battle conjured a new nightmare. Samara is the kind of soldier we need in this war. Nothing gets in her way. I just hope I'm not in her way someday. That woman means business. This human holds such childish views of war. Your species has much to learn. It's a brilliant tactic, when you think about it. When has that ever mattered in war? Say that again? The population of the colony world of Tyvor has been killed. I don't understand. The Reapers have been taking people alive. It was self-inflicted. When Reaper forces invaded, Tyvor's colonists detonated nuclear weapons inside their cities. Goddess. Their deaths would have been instantaneous, Doctor. Thank you, Glyph. That'll be all. Poor Rila. 
glad she set off that bomb, Shepard. You're not upset the monastery was destroyed? No. Not after what I saw. I don't care that they were Ardat Yakshi. To be turned into such creatures, nobody deserves that. Thank you for the data packet. The results are available on the Information Network Terminal. chair or something. You know, in the old days, they didn't have automatic cameras. Reporters had to cake on the makeup. something. Signal confirmed.
have located Ann Bryson's dig site. We have reports of an attack at this excavation site. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. 
Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Yes. The attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional complications. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. We have hostile! Take us in! Commander, on the landing platform! That's her!
Looks like a bridge over there. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Right away, Commander. The wires have sustained damage. I'll need a moment to repair. Spotted Shepard. Got it. And the elevator's blocked. Is there another way up? I'll override the pod door near you. There's an access point above, Commander, but you'll have to climb to it. Copy that.
Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry! He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? Sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh, God. Yes, of course.
I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact? Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! What are they doing? They've activated... I've never managed anything... Doctor... They've learned too well. The darkness must not be breached. Shepard! Take it out! Got it! You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle? You run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Okay? Yeah, Commander. I, I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of you. We got the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor. I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers. Never went back to dark space. Like a rogue. Or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne. You need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... 
What? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine. The next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Anne? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation and meet you there. Commander, Chief Engineer Adams would like to speak with you down in engineering. of that thermal pipe you got us. I went right, brilliant. Much better than we expected. I told you it would. It gets better. You should go see Adams, Commander. Adams would like to speak to you. Epiphany. I wouldn't go that far. You should go see Adams, Commander. Theoretical improvements to our capacitor design. Edie and I ran with it and documented our conclusions. Our core is too compact to apply our theories. I could help the Crucible engineers. Give the word and I'll send the plans their way. Do it. Well done, everyone.
We're outshipped four to one, and most of our vessels are transports with limited firepower. We're not here to win a space battle, Jarl. We just have to punch through their line. So, you've commandeered a Cerberus cruiser. The guest of honor has arrived. We can finally start. Let me guess. You're planning on infiltrating the enemy fleet. Exactly. We position ourselves to strike a crippling blow, then my forces join the fun. A lot could go wrong. The assault's been planned for weeks, Shepard. For now, just sit back. Let me steer. Not the best start to our partnership, Arya. How things begin isn't nearly as important as how they end. Ray, move through the relay. Signal the fleet to wait. They only follow on my command. Say that. The hard way. That's right. Nice and slow. Be patient. As close 
as you can. straight for the station. We're being hailed by the general. Should be interesting. Put him through. Arya, I knew this had to be you. You'll never make it. Pull it off now. You're barking up the wrong tree, general. But maybe you can convince my partner. Commander Shepard, I've heard great things about you. My partner here doesn't have much to say for you. She's not used to being defeated. Clouds of judgment. A pity you left, Cerberus. We all sabotage ourselves in nefarious ways. Perhaps deep down you fear success. And Arya clearly thinks seeing you will unsettle me. Now it's my turn. I see you've gone to the trouble of augmenting that ship with Solaris armoring. An exorbitant waste. I've made improvements to Omega's outer defenses. My cannons will cut through you at will. He sounds pretty confident. Yeah, he does. So again, I say turn back. Let's see what you've got, Oleg. End transmission. That went well. Set preset course. We're ramming the station. Everyone brace for impact. What? Omega's kinetic barrier will stop my ships from landing. I equipped this cruiser with disruptors to take it out on impact. Don't worry. We'll probably survive the crash. Shields gone! All systems failing! We can make it! Arya, don't be stupid. Sound the evac! Damn it! Program escape pods for the station. Let's go! Everyone out! There's no time! Guess that asshole really did upgrade Omega's outer defenses. So it would seem. Escape pods made it. All right. What's our target? Need to hit the defense system station. Shut down Omega's outer defense so my ships can land. If we don't, they'll be blown to bits like we were. Got it. This is what I brought you. Ground. In combat, what you say goes. Arya relinquishing command? I'll believe it when I see it. I can be a team player, Commander. I know where we need to go, and you can get us there. Okay, let's move. I'm back, you fuckers.
Our pod took out the main exit. Use the controls to lower the blast door. Over here, Shepard. Aria to fleet. You alive out there? Barely. Holding our own with the Cerberus fleet, but Omega's defenses are shredding us. Keep my army intact, Gerald. That is your only job. Tell your boss I'm coming for him. Team, report in. Bray, you there? Affirmative. We always six pods, man. Various entry points. Rally them to you, then head for the rendezvous hangar. Start prepping for our ships to land. Let's hustle. Every minute, more of my ships get obliterated out there. Those cannons have to be stopped. Next area needs to be repressurized. Initiating.
almost done it. One of our pods. We were lucky. Press on. Lost two more transports. Can't keep up with these maneuvers much longer. We're right outside the defense station. Hold tight! Controls. Security override in effect. Down, signal the surviving ships to converge on the rendezvous point. Hi. Approach trajectories plotted. We're already queuing up. Bray, come in. Status. Rendezvous site secured. Hangar doors enabled. We'll have them open soon. Need them open now. My birds are coming in. Prep for reception. What exactly is this rendezvous point? That's where we're headed. It's a bunker I established on D-Deck for my more sensitive operations. It's utterly impenetrable with its own secret hangar and dock. Independent power source, life support, munitions. You'll see. Deploy to D-Deck. Investigate and await further instructions. Good chance the general knows where we're going. Then no time for sightseeing. Bray, stay sharp. You might get visitors. Terrific. Take the far exit. I've locked down the way we came. Causing a stir. Good. Feels good to let loose. The Omega Skyline. Now I feel like I'm back. Strange. What are those things in the distance? Some kind of force field. That's not good.
We're getting close to the rendezvous. Let's move. I know that symbol. Looks like a gang tag. The Talons. They used to deface my property, too. Warning. Omega has been compromised. All Cerberus personnel report to stations. The Talon symbol again. Hmm. Could be evidence of a resistance. Might be useful. One of my soldiers by the force field. Mechs are coming through the force field. Stand still, you piece of shit. Need to check out that force field. Over here, Shepard. Poor idiot. Something tells me these force fields are going to be a problem. Are we blocked? Not this time. Come here. This way. What are you doing? Letting you in on a secret. Down the ladder. Who's there? Show yourself. Spirits, look who's back. Aria Talok. Nyreen, what the hell are you doing here? Playing cat and mouse, mostly. Just trying to stay alive. If it wasn't for these tunnels. My tunnels. I'm sure glad I showed them to you. If you hadn't, I'd be dead or locked up by now. Arya doesn't trust easily. I guess you're a good friend. I don't know. Are we, Arya? Shepard, this is Nyrene Kandros, ex-Turian military. We go way back. I've got a lot of questions, but they'll have to wait. Follow us, we'll get you to safety. I'll do my best. 
Ready to put that gun to good use? You have no idea how ready. So why are you back, Arya? To reclaim what's mine. Left something behind, I take it. Not something. Everything. What's the fleet's status? Still landing inside the bunker. Keep the enemy out. Lock it down. Now. Lower blast doors. Lower the blast doors. the enemy. Get them off you.
Got him. We're in, lock it down. Arya, I know this place is built like a fortress, but is it safe now that the general's clued in? Yeah. I feel like a sitting duck here. I have no intention of sitting around, and you both should know I assume nothing. And on that front, Nyrene, you left Omega fairly angry with me. I wasn't aware you'd returned. Explain yourself. The truth is, I never left. In fact, I went to great lengths to keep her. I'm not easily duped. Well done. But why? I just... couldn't leave. Considering all this, I wish I had. Well, you always said I'd be the death of you. Nyrene has military training. We can put her to good use. You're so quick to trust, huh, Shepard? Nyrene never approved of Omega's, what did you call it? Moral bankruptcy? Are you willing to help defend it now? You'll find me very willing to liberate this station. Your combat skills seem a little rusty, but you're still a good shot. See my duty officer. Bray, keep an eye on her. Will do. All right, Shepard, we need to move fast. I'm itching for revenge. If you think I'm gonna let you carve a bloody path through this campaign, you're sadly mistaken. And if you think you're going to change me, well, you're welcome to try. Once up and running, this bunker will provide recon and secret access to much of the station. I'd appreciate it if you would quickly eyeball operations, see that things are setting up smoothly. What will you be doing? Checking in on my forces. I need to know how many survived the assault before I can plan the attack.
It won't take long. Join me at the command console when you're ready. What's the trouble here? Power recruiters are shorting, trying to find a workaround, but no go. They can probably be scrounged up somewhere on Omega. If you come across a set of carrying murders, bring them back here. I'll see what I can do. Rock. Rock, you there? I swear, if you don't answer soon, finally. Where are you? You don't know? Seriously? Look, just check your army. Rerouting system. Commander, if you have a moment. What is it? I've been tasked with increasing this command center's control of Omega's operating systems. I've hacked surveillance on many decks, tapped various internal communication conduits, but I can only reach so far. There are terminals in Cerberus-controlled areas, and, well, you could get your hands on them. When you find these terminals, a simple input code will give me access privileges and more influence on station systems. Easy enough. Good. I'll keep an eye on my board, and I'll let you know when my codes are activated. Thanks. Supplies are gonna be tight. We haven't lost that ship. This area is still unsecure. Off limits for now, Commander. Well, yeah. Cerberus knows we're here. We'll be setting up combat ship, so pay attention to the roster updates. We also lost the supplies. This is me saying make everything. How are we looking? All systems operational. Full Omega schematics coming online now. Let's take a look. I see. Shepard, those force fields we saw. The General has them set up everywhere. He's controlling access across the station. What are these dark areas? Many sections of Omega are powered down. I'm betting power is being siphoned to run those force fields. Find the source, priority one. And we'll need a full tactical assessment of all Cerberus positions. I'll get on it. Shepard, we have work to do. Our losses were significant. We can't field an army large enough to face down Cerberus. Then we need to find allies. Story of my life. We've confirmed there is a Merc gang that's still active. The Talons are resisting the occupation. Not my first choice, but they're all we've got. Then it's time to play diplomat. And if the current leader won't join us, the next one will. Sorry to interrupt. What is it? I turned away for a second to offload supplies when I looked back. You lost her. Well, I... We're locked down. She's gotta be here somewhere. This bunker has secret access points to other parts of the station. Unfortunately, Nyrene knows them. Damn it, Bray. If I wasn't already short on manpower. We have to focus on getting the Talons on board. Shepard, I'll meet you at the armory exit when you're ready to go. 
But don't keep me waiting. Investigating subverse activity. Ma'am. Yes, what is it? Got a minute? We need to get going. But what's on your mind? It seems like there's more to Nyreen than meets the eye. You mean her disappearing act? Honestly, I'm not concerned. If it was anyone else, I'd want blood, but Nyreen's a variable I can control. She believes in a code of ethics. She oozes virtue. You two must have made an interesting pair. Opposites attract, right? Our connection was powerful but doomed. Nyreen demonstrated zero flexibility. She couldn't put up with the challenges of my life. That's all you're getting out of me on this subject, Shepard. Anything else? Tell me about this Merc gang we're looking to enlist. They're drug runners and cutthroats, but they're highly organized. That sets them apart. They appear more civilized than, say, the Blood Pack, but at their heart, they're just as dishonorable. We'll have to appeal to their lust and greed to get and keep them in line. Anything else you need to know? Once we recruit the Talons, how do we reach the General? I'm working on it. His command center set up an afterlife. No doubt a deliberate move to piss me off. Don't let it get to you. He wants you off balance. Anger helps me focus. Those strange force fields are blocking access to much of the station, including afterlife. So after we complete our current objective, I'll be looking for a way to get around them. Enough talk. Is there anything else or can we move on? Tell me more about Petrovsky. He presumes to sit on my throne, that's all that matters. I get that you hate him, Arya, but I need to know who we're up against. All right, I'll admit he's not like other Cerberus operatives I've encountered. He's smart, thinks outside the box, very hard to predict. He's like his boss, no matter who suffers and no matter the cost, he stops at nothing. To defeat him, we have to be prepared to do the same. Is the cross-examination over because time is of the essence? You're off the hook for now. Good. I'll meet you at the exit by the armory. Good luck out there. What's your history with this gang? Some mutually beneficial dealings and some occasional violence. The Talons weren't even a blip on our radar until the plague in 2185. Your little war against the other gangs left a vacuum. Not my intention. Their leader, Darius, took advantage of the situation and carved the Talons a bigger piece of the local drug trade. Are we enlisting them because they're good or because we need numbers? Their cannon fodder, we're using them because they're the only game in town. You're gonna let them know that? Relax, Shepard. This is how it works on Omega. Just let me do the talking and...
like we fight our way through Cerberus to get to them. Let's move. Why would they leave crates of red sand lying around like this? Maybe they had something more important going on. Not Darius. Prophet is the only thing that matters to him. Anything else can burn. One of these air shafts should lead us to Talon territory. offline. Looks like they were using this to observe the detainment centers. That tower is the Talon outpost we're heading for. Looks like the Talons are given as good as they get.
Understood.
Take care of the wounded, and scavenge what you can. I want us out of here ASAP. You heard the boss. Move it. Looks like we found the Talon leader. My, my. Nyrene, aren't you full of surprises? Arya, the deception was necessary. I needed to figure out what your plans were. The people on Omega depend on us. I couldn't risk compromising our operation. Not exactly standard procedures for a street gang. When Cerberus invaded, the Talons were a mess. I brought... a new direction. The General's been hunting us ever since. Right now, he's attacking one of our outposts. That's where I need to be. We're done here, boss. Right. Aria, Commander Shepard, whatever you're here for, the answer is no. Kindly escort yourselves off Talon territory. We're here to help. We'll talk about it after we reach your outpost. That's a generous offer. Aria, does the Commander also speak for you? Not the way I would have put it, but that's the idea. All right then. Come with me. You've improved your biotics since last I saw you. You noticed the biotic grenades? You always did like blowing things up, given half a chance. Rampart mechs incoming!
This way. I hope you're not afraid of heights. Lockdown system's been compromised so many times it hardly knows up from down anymore. Nirene to base. Need an engineer at the catwalk's entrance. Door's jammed again. This may take a moment. You're not just using the catwalks as a secret passage to the base, are you? A long drop is the best way to get rid of unwanted guests around here. Working on it. They've hacked the bridge controls.
doors open. Let's go. Hurry up. I need to get to my people. We'll be evacuating this location as soon as possible. Try not to interfere with my people's work. Intel just reported in. The group of civilians we managed to evac arrived safely at the other outpost. Also, routine sweeps reporting nothing new on the adjutant presence. Adjutants? Creatures created by Cerberus. They eviscerate their victims' DNA, converting them into more adjutants. Some kind of Reaper-based weapon. I fought them before they're a nightmare. It got worse after you left. Cerberus lost control of them. Those things tore apart the gangs, then attacked everyone in sight. If Cerberus hadn't found a way to contain them, the entire station would be infected by now. Keeping your people alive through that couldn't have been easy. I watched friends get turned into monsters. And I had to kill them. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an outpost to defend. The adjutants really got under her skin. Here, we found more medical supplies. All yours. Hey, Commander. I just wanted to say thank you. Just reported into the boss. Still no idea. Cerberus is backing off for now. Make sure the scouts keep an eye out for the next attack. You've done an excellent job, Nyrene, but I'll be taking over now. You know what happens to people who argue with me. And if I say no, you'll just kill me and take over? My people won't stand for that. Yes, they do seem nauseatingly loyal. Either way, I'll get what I want. Not this time. The truth is, none of us can do this alone. Our only chance is to join forces. You might be right. But the people of Omega are my priority. You take over one gang, and you think you're ready to decide what's best for Omega? Nyreen, watch and learn. As... Everything's in place. The entire station's connected. People of Omega, I have returned. Cerberus believes they have beaten you. They believe they have you under control. They are gravely mistaken. You are the lawless of the galaxy. You cannot be beaten, and you will never be controlled. Be ready. 
Your chance to strike out against your oppressors is coming. Together we will take Omega back! That's your plan? Throw civilians at Cerberus? Anything is better than being locked up like mindless animals waiting for slaughter. I know what you're up to, Arya. And I don't like it. I have civilians to evacuate. I'll deal with this later. All right, let's get these people ready to go. Now! What are you trying to do? Trying? The people of Omega. My people. Love a good street fight. When it breaks loose, they'll be ready. Nyrene's code of ethics won't let her sit by if civilians are exposed. It's what makes her utterly predictable and therefore easy to manipulate. Cerberus is launching another offensive. Looks like I'm not the only one who didn't like your little speech, Arya. Glad I got his attention. Commander, landing pads are yours. My people and I will hold the main doors. Got it.
Talons will join your cause. Someone's got to make sure you don't run roughshod over our people. You see, Shepard. Let me guess. She said I was predictable and therefore easy to manipulate. Pretty much word for word. She thinks she's playing you. Nothing new here. One thing, though. I maintain command over my people. This is not up for debate. Just have them ready. Oh, they'll be ready. We're almost there, Shepard. The Talons will be the frontline fodder, now we just need to bring down the force fields to clear the way to afterlife. Which will release Omega's civilians. Cerberus will have a million fires to put out. In one fell swoop, we'll have the people in the Talons working for us. You might not want to compromise your alliance before it even takes shape. I've learned not to put much stock in truth and goodwill. It might be time to start again. Tell you what, I'll take it under advisement. Now, I'll be at the command console plotting our next move. Urgently, your attention, if you please. Things are starting to heat up over here. We need to bring you in fast. Rock? Rock, can you hear me? Damn it, Rock, don't do that again. Urgently, your attention, if you please. This door's on lockdown. Blocked enemy access to critical areas. The frontal assault should be less treacherous. They think they have us trapped in here. 